These three toys dramatically helped me train my dog and improve my relationship with him. The first toy, believe it or not, is this little pig. It's made out of rubber, which makes it pretty durable. And there's a little squeaker inside, which adds another layer of fun for your dog. The way that I like to use this toy with Winston is that I like to play fetch. And of course you can use a ball instead of the pig, but the reason why I think the pig is much better than the ball is because of the way that I throw it. See, when I play with him, I like to spin the pig, and in doing so, when it hits the ground, the pig kind of jumps around everywhere, and if Winston wants to catch it, he has to have good coordination. So this adds another layer of excitement and enjoyment for him when he actually catches it, or you could just throw it in the air for him to catch. This next toy is my secret weapon. I have gained so much out of it, it's unbelievable. Without it, I wouldn't be nearly as far I am with Winston that I am today. I've trained recalls, I've trained sits, downs, comes, all the obedience training that he needs is because of this single toy. And that is this rope. If you guys are not using tug toys, I highly, highly recommend it. It's a game changer. It really is. When I first got Winston, I didn't really use the tug toy. I want to use other methods to train him. But as soon as I used this toy, everything just kind of fell into place. Now, the reason why this toy is so good is because when you're playing with him, you are directly engaging with him. He's holding on one end, you're holding on the other, and you guys are tugging. They might even let out a play growl. You guys are staring into each other's eyes. You can throw the toy and play fetch with it. It's a very versatile toy. Now what's really good about it, especially indoors, is when you play tug and you're kind of on the slippery surface like ceramic tiles or a wooden floor. Your dog is really gonna pull on that toy, but they're gonna be slipping. And they're pulling with all of their might and they're gonna get exhausted from it. I mean, let them win a little bit, but you can really tire them out this way. The last toy on this list is a Frisbee, but not any ordinary Frisbee, the Kong Frisbee. The reason why I love this toy so much is because it's made out of rubber. It's safe. Where I live in Canada, it gets cold, and when it gets cold, plastic cracks but I don't gotta worry about that with this toy. And on top of that, when I'm playing fetch with Fris- when I'm playing fetch with Frisbee? When I'm playing fetch with Winston, I don't gotta worry about him accidentally biting his tongue and kind of bleeding everywhere. It's made out of rubber. He can catch it however he wants to. He could catch it like this, he could catch it like this. You know, he could do whatever he wants with it. It's not gonna hurt him. The main purpose of this toy is to expel energy as quickly as possible. And we use these three toys on a daily basis and it has dramatically improved my relationship with my dog and his training. Thank you so much for watching. Please consider liking and subscribing and I'll see you guys next time.